Hey guys, how are we doing? It's Brian from Canadian Trailer Company. Uh, we're excited to start uh, the 2020s, coming down the line here now, our cargo trailers. And I want to show you what's different about them. For all the 2020s uh, that you order now, we've gone to a new brake controlling system, a breakaway switch. So I'm going to show you what it is. This here is the breakaway switch that you would hook to your tow vehicle. And you, you run it through the tow vehicle and bring it back to itself okay like that hook it on and then when this pulls apart if the trailer is ever to come unhooked this breakaway pulls apart and that locks the brakes on so the trailer doesn't get running away on you this is the battery that the majority of people use this is the new battery that we will be using what this battery comes with is a, a complete wiring harness this here now this is the old uh, cord that we used to use where it's it's connected here uh, and we used to strip and, and crimp our own wires here now we don't we buy a different cord this cord now is good to 40 plus below zero all these ends are put on by machine so it's a lot better than us doing it this is nice too that if you ever if this plug comes unhooked and you drag it on the ground for some reason you don't have to replace the whole cord uh, you can just undo this uh, do this end piece here and just replace that okay what happens here is this hooks into your truck and this hooks into this pin box here okay again it's all uh, done by machine there that hooks into this pin box and then from this pin box the wiring harness starts and this is really nice now this new wiring harness uh, we run it in the front of the trailer and up and across the ceiling which means it never gets in the way of anybody if you want to put cupboards in, in or uh, do some kind of renovation to the side of the trailer where you'll be drilling screws into the side. You're not going to cut through the wiring harness. So what we do is we cut the plywood. If we're in a, a six foot six trailer, we cut the plywood six foot five, and that leaves us an inch that we can run this wiring harness across the top of the plywood. And then we put a piece of trim on it, it's a two inch trim, to trim the whole interior so that you don't see any of that wiring. If you ever want to add wiring or add lights, you just have to take the trim off and uh, put your lights on. So this is the wiring harness. I didn't pull all of this apart because it's, it looks like a bit of a mess here, but this all unravels and it goes to all the lights, drops down. And this is kind of what happens. This would, would go up to say a bullet light, for instance. And then your bullet lights, rather than crimping and, and doing all this work, uh, it's all done by machinery. And then they just plug in like this and this is done. So if you ever want to change the light, it's just that fast. So uh, this is the big step. Uh, in the cargo trailer business for us and uh, we want to be uh, way ahead of the competition that's why we've gone this route.